What up friends, my name is Gambo and I make, I make videos for me on YouTube. Um, I'll be playing a 10 minute round again on chess. Um, so yeah. Oh man. After what happened uh, the last video on chess, uh, I really don't, I really don't want, want the level to go down again, because uh, that will <laughs> that will be tragic if that happens. But um, yeah, we'll just have to wait and see. You may notice that I've actually um, got rid of the, um, you know, the crop bars on my um, window capture, because yeah, that, that yeah, those bars don't look very professional um, in, in a YouTube video. So um, just got rid of those. Alright, here we go. I go. Queen's pawn open. By the way, the reason why I don't talk much in my game gaming videos and like um is because I like, I really want to like concentrate on playing and I like, enjoy the game. Um Especially on chess, because like chess is um, kind of chess is a time-consuming game, and um, it's it's a game that you have to concentrate like the whole time, like um, from the start to the finish of the game. So yeah, that's why I don't so much in the gaming videos. Oh, no connection again. Yes. Win by ten. I really want to win like, on this one, then. The level go, goes up by 10 and I really want to pull in again. You know, I think I've just kind of got an habit of like not checking, um, like for the pieces, for, for the other pieces, like um, in case we can check. But, oh yes, get in mate, you just put, just messed up there. Really messed up, mate. Um, start moving on this rock over here. So he's got four four um, important pieces. I've got five. So yeah. and you know if if you think about the pawn promotion, you kind of want you kind of want to get the pawns out, like a lot of the pawns out as well, like just because just they're they're the least important piece in in chess. Um, you also want to. You still want to think about getting the pawns up, um, like, because you don't want your opponent to do a pawn promotion on you, because that, because then there's more more chance of you losing, because he might he might still have his original queen from um, from the start of the game, um, and then he might create another one. So yeah, and now like, yeah, I've kings and checking my queen.
that was lucky because I, cause I, cause I didn't check uh, for any other pieces that were like that were getting the qu that queen checks, but there's not luckily. So you really want to think about like what you're doing on your moves, which is what I sometimes, which is, most of the time I don't think about that. But I'm actually, yeah, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna think about that from now on because I'm gonna end up losing like all the time if I don't start thinking about that. So yeah, another tip. Yeah, you kind of want to keep your eye on like every single piece in the game, especially the king. Because, yeah, you want to get the king check, don't you? Oh. Actually, um, Actually drawn yesterday in the game um, by stalemate. Um, your level, yeah, your level um, like it goes up by a small number if you draw by stalemate. Because yeah, if you draw, you go up by two or or, or whatever number it is. See, I checked properly there. I put all, like, uh, like um, all around me. I check if any piece was was to get that queen in check if I move it there, but it's not. So, yeah, that was okay. Now, is the no? There's not, so I can get that. No, yeah. there's no piece that I can get it in check. Yeah, so I think that's one of the main things that you have to do um, to actually get more chance of winning in chess. Like to check all around you, like for the pe for any piece that can get your other piece of yeah, uh, your other piece in check. Otherwise, you lose it. I'm afraid. So yeah. Two minutes behind me. The good thing about um, like, like not taking, well, you should take your time. But, but while the opponent's thinking about his move and he and he's taking time, you can like start to think about your move. But when you do that, the good thing about that is like if you're if you're losing and the opponent's winning, but the opponent's got less time than you. Um, your levels can still go up even if you lose so yeah that's good right. I'm killing his pieces there with my queen
not very cloudy today, um, but there are a few clouds. Is um, oh. some lag then. It's probably why it's taking time. Come on. By the way, if you if you plan on if if you're planning on um, learning how to play chess and playing chess then for the first um well yeah for the first few weeks or something you have to um at the start um like when you just started learning to play chess you need to um play and um, need to create um long long games like 15 20 minutes because that actually gives you time to um think about your moves and yeah and it also gives you good gives you good practice um, if you pick long, long games and I suppose ten minutes, ten minute, the ten minute game is um, a long, fairly long game, but um, it's kind of not. It's kind of in between the middle, to be honest. So, yeah, but yeah, picking long games to play in chess is a good way to um, get good at chess because, you know, like I said, you're thinking about your moves more, but more time. So if you're a beginner at chess, I, I don't, I don't really recommend going on bullet chess and bullet chess if you if you don't know what that is bullet chess is um, basically basically a one minute game of chess um or like a short amount of time like 50 seconds or something which i've tried i've, I've attempted that before and yeah of course i lost but <laughs> oh man i think you think you have to get like really good at chess to like to play bullet chess but I'm not really good. I'm not, I'm not a professional, but I'm still quite good. Oh, you resigned. Okay. Oh, at least the, at least the level's gone up by ten. Well. Wow. <laughs>